Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Indy 500 project. Today's experiment, a virus named Tom, which is a quirky little name for a virus. We've never met a virus named Tom before. We met some named Jimmy and a few named Adam, but not, never Tom. None of that is true, but here's something that is true. This game is developed and published by Misfits Addicts. Misfits Attic. And they don't care about wholesome, they don't care about family, they only care about the fun part of it all. And here's what the game has to say about itself. A perfect place, a city without traffic, a dog that doesn't poop. All products of the brilliant mind of Dr. X. But hell hath no fury, like a mad scientist fired by a giant corporation. In this unique action puzzle, you take control of Tom, a virus created for one purpose, the revenge, the revenge of Dr. X. <clears throat> Hack your way through brain scrambling puzzles while maneuvering through a thumb cramping maze of enemies. Team up through over 50 cooperative levels in what MMGN is calling the most addictive co-op game we've played since Portal 2. Which is actually quite amazing uh, praise, because Portal 2 was so much fun in co-op. And if the over 100 levels aren't enough, you and your friends can destroy each other again and again in battle mode to determine just who is the supreme virus. As the description says, and as the menu shows you, there is cooperative play and there is versus battle. But we are here to check out what the single play story has to offer. You have to understand, everything was wonderful. I was creating the future. Metal dogs that didn't poop. I even cured walking. Then I invented Globotron, which would destroy anyone found walking. That's when it happened. Megatech. Crazy, they said. How is that even profitable, they said. And that's when they fired me. Me. Dr. X. Me, the inventor of their precious city. Their precious city. Well, I have one last invention for them. Oh, I know they'll love him. I call him Tom. Tom is actually kind of cute. But I gotta say, I'm sticking with Meta Mega Corporation at this Megacorp uh, in this junction. I don't really see the profits in killing anyone that is found walking or running. That's just... Why? Why would you do that? Ah. Here's Tom. And we're gonna infect the pet of tomorrow. Tom, it's Dr. Hex. Let's get you up to speed. Maybe that was a little bit too creepy. <clears throat> I'm going to start the infection from out here. I need you to reconfigure the circuitry to spread the virus throughout the entire circuit. I designed you to move along the grid lines. Left analog stick. All right, you can use the analog sticks on your 3 seat controller or you can use a keyboard. Doesn't really matter as long as you use something. To rotate a circuit piece, hold A or spacebar and move around it. We can do that. Now the virus can spread from nya to nya. When every piece in the circuit is infected, contamination will be complete. Jumping, jumping, complete. Now go forth, Tom. Infect! We shall do just that. Here we are, moving along the grid. Hold A and rotate. Oh, that. Did a little too much there. New record. Good to hear. Mm, yeah, I think I got this. What we're gonna do, we're gonna rotate this one, yeah, and we're gonna rotate that one, yeah. It didn't really end up in something, it's just the whole circuit was infected. They've activated some lame antivirus drones. They underestimate, underestimate you, and therefore me, Dr. X. <laughs> They'll drain your energy. Oh, so it's energy based, not like health. Or, mm, actually, just keep you powered while. Actually, just keeping you powered will slowly drain. Oh, that's no good. 
Let's deal it, darling. More infecting. We'll see if we can make you proud. Um, do they follow any sort of pattern? Let's see here. We want that one to go there. That one goes there. That one goes there. And this one goes there. Flawless. Silver only. Maybe we used too much energy or didn't complete it fast enough. Soon there will be no more dog. And... Hmm. Which way do we actually want to go with it? Uh, not that way. We want to go the... But how will we infect that one then? Hmm. Oh, let's see. Let's go that way and let's go this way. Hmm. Now, the final piece. How do we reach the final piece? I actually don't know. And we're gonna lose our gold rating. See that orange one above, above Tom's head? That's the gold rating disappearing. That would be the silver rating, and uh, we just lost gold. Um, well, we can't really do this, can we? No, because then that happens. Oh, that's another power source. Oh, I didn't see that. Yeah, we can retry that one just to get a gold gold rating here. I totally missed that that had a separate power source. Yeah, 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 hold on, hold on. There we go. Gold rate. Silver. Ah. We gotta be quicker. Sit. <laughs> Speak. Yay. Roll over. Roll over and die, you devil dog. No more puppies! Oh, a teleporter. I can wait to mess with that one. Hope we can get some fly stuff going on. <laughs> uh, Megadex seems to be taking it in stride. Hmm. Interesting. earn some skip tokens you can use them to f on the failure screen to skip a level now that you'll not that you'll need them I'm hoping I won't I usually try to stick around and make sure that I actually complete levels without skipping any but who knows that's not helpful is it This was actually tricky. Hmm. 
Hmm. Yeah, we're gonna need to do this and this instead, and... Oh. Um... Hmm. Well, let's turn you around. This is tricky. We don't even know what you are, but... Is there a way to get... Yeah, there is. Ah! And we got spiders. Ow, oh, that was just plain stupid. Oh, that drained a lot of energy straight out. I flipped you the wrong way. There we go. Can we get a gold one? No. Apparently we're spending too much energy. Well, especially if we die by the first thing we do. But yeah, this gameplay is simple enough. Upgrade. More drones are upgrade you with glitches. I even just invented the name. Right trigger or shift key. Oh, so you can like fire glitches. Glitches. I just inv invented a word as well. Glitches, where two drones will collide and watch the fireworks. Ah. And. Yeah! Got him. Now let me work in peace. No, this is not going to work. I need to do something different here. But I have no idea how. I mean, this one isn't the power source no matter how I turn it. All right, I got to turn this one over there. And I got to go... Uh, ah. That way first. Am I out of glitches? No, I'm not out of glitches. Maybe I spent energy while doing glitches. There we go. I managed to solve it anyways. But yeah, that is a very quirky little puzzler. Very action-driven puzzler. Whoa, that was... <laughs> now we're actually gonna die because we got no energy left. And that is energy depleted. Let's try that one again. And let's try not to be foolish this time. No, that didn't work out, did it? <laughs> yeah, we're gonna call it quits there. And you can see that this is a very quirky little puzzler with a big action moment. You gotta be on your toes, very reactive. And you can compete with your friends. And you can compete with... And you can co cooperate with your friends. Which is always a nice feature. No idea how that gameplay is though. But maybe someday we'll find out. But yeah, that has been a virus named Tom. So until next time, happy gaming. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Indy 500 project. Today's experiment, a virus named Tom, which is a quirky little name for a virus. 
We've never met a virus named Tom before. We met some named Jimmy and a few named Adam, but not, never Tom. None of that is but hell hath no fury like a mad scientist fired by a giant corporation. In this unique action puzzle, you take control of Tom, a virus created for one purpose. The revenge, the revenge of Dr. X. <clears throat> Hack your way through brain scrambling puzzles while maneuvering through a thumb cramping maze of enemies. It's the supreme virus. As the description says, and as the menu shows you, there is cooperative play and there is versus battle. But we are here to check out what the single play story has to offer. You have to understand, everything was wonderful. I was creating the future. Metal dogs. It's true, but here's something that is true. This game is developed and published by Misfits Addicts. Misfits Attic. And they don't care about wholesome, they don't care about family, they only care about the fun part of it all. And here's what the game has to say about itself. A perfect place, a city without traffic, a dog that doesn't poop. All products of the brilliant mind of Dr. X. Team up through over 50 cooperative levels in what MMGN is calling the most addictive co-op game we've played since Portal 2. Which is actually quite amazing uh, praise because Portal 2 was so much fun in co-op. And if the over 100 levels aren't enough, you and your friends can destroy each other again and again in battle mode to determine just who 